welcome to this Oracle Database 12C demonstration. My name is Maria Billings. I work for Oracle Server Technologies Curriculum. This demonstration shows you how to use the predefined Swiss backup privilege and user. Oracle provides them first in release 12.1 to facilitate the separation of database administration duties. We will create simple test tables without any grants to show you the difference between Swiss DBA and Swiss Backup. At the end of the demo, we log into Amen with the Swiss Backup privilege and execute some Amen and SQL commands. For example, the select and describe commands whose functionality have been enhanced in release 12.1. On the slide you see the precise steps that we will be taking. First, we log on as SysDBA using OS authentication. Now, logged into SQL Plus, I'm executing some formatting commands for the ease of reading before executing my query against the DBA user's view. Here you see the output, the Sys Backup user. You can also log into SQL Plus using OS authentication with the Sys Backup privilege. And in this case, you are connected as this Sys Backup user. You can execute the same command as this Sys DBA user you see the results are the same. Oracle recommends that you create your own uh, privileged user, which we do as SysDBA. So here we are creating the sample user account called MySysDBA and granting it the Sys Backup privilege. We can review again the account status for all users who have the word Sys as part of their name and you see the newly created user account. If you are curious about the granted system privileges, we can use the DBA Sys Privs Data Dictionary V. And I'm querying the Sys Backup Privileges. The column ADM means that Backup does not have the With Admin option and COM means it is common, yes, for container databases of Oracle multi-tenant. To view details about the granted role, we use the DBA role proofs data dictionary view. Let's create a test table space. The details are not really important. Or you could also use the Scott Amp table. So I'd first like to show you the just created test tables. Here they are. Logged in as Swiss Backup, you cannot view the table content. Finally, we view the password file, and you see that the Swiss Backup and my Swiss Backup users do not have Swiss DBA privileges or Swiss OPA privileges. You also see that the container database is not configured for this demonstration, so the value is zero. Next, we use the Sys Backup Privileges with Amen. You log into Amen by specifying as Sys Backup within single quotes and double quotes. We execute some command in this case, looking at the schemas, and you see that our sample database has the data files in ASM. Here is our test table space. If you're curious about the content of the test TBS, you can execute a select command from within Armin. With 12.1, that is simplified. You do not need the SQL keyword anymore. We can also execute queries and see that this database is in archive log mode and open read write. You can use the describe command in Armin. As you see here within the spelled out version, or you can use the abbreviated DESC. On the slide, you see the steps which we just covered in this demo. Thanks for watching this demonstration.